the little red kite. We can learn something only if we try. Let us see how the little red kite learned to fly. Harry looked up at the sky. It was a lovely day. The tall trees were swaying slowly in the breeze. The clouds were high in the blue sky. It looked as though someone had taken bits of cotton wool and stuck them up in the sky. It was a perfect day for flying kites. But Harry's little red kite didn't seem to think so. When Minnie threw the kite up, it skipped a little and then dragged on the grass. It didn't rise up at all. Harry's brother Ravi had a big green and yellow kite. His friend threw it up and at once it flew into the sky. Come on, little red kite, said Harry. Fly, fly, do fly into the sky. You will have fun. But the little kite just trembled a little and lay down quietly on the ground. Oh, I can't do it, thought the little kite. I'm so afraid. I might fall on a sharp branch or a cruel thorn. I could get hurt. Come on, little kite, don't be afraid, said Harry. Minnie said, Maybe the little kite is afraid of these bushes and trees. Let's go to the middle of the park. So the two children took the kite to the middle of the park, which was an open and grassy space. There were no bushes or trees around. Now you must try hard when I throw you up, Minnie told the kite. Minnie ran fast with the little kite, and Harry held the string firmly. Then Minnie jumped up and threw the kite as high as she could. The kite felt a little stir in its tail. It tried really hard. It gave a big push when it felt a breeze. The breeze soon whooshed it up. The red kite felt very excited. Oh, I'm flying! I'm flying! sang the little kite as it pulled at the string. It could see the park below grow smaller and smaller. After a while, Minnie and Hurry were little dots at the end of the string. Now the little kite was flying near the other kites. Welcome, little one, said a kind blue kite. The little kite waved its tail as it sailed away. It loved the blue sky. It loved sailing in the breeze. It loved looking at the clouds that were still far above. Ah, you made it after all said Ravi's green and yellow kite as it came close. Look out for that huge purple monster. It could hurt you. However, the little red kite just whooshed up and down as it flew away. It was not afraid anymore. It was enjoying itself very much.